<laughs> but every time when I get to church, when I'm like, every time I get up and go to church, it's like the people next door are always getting up, like watching me, watching me, watching me, like watching me. Like, what for? Are you related to that Indian guy? It seems that way. You might be one of his people that you moved in. So now you got to watch me. Like, why are you watching me? That's real suspicious. You got to keep your eyes out for people like that. If you feel that way, you're being watched. And bad vibes. Because it's nothing but negativity. Anyone that cause fear in you. But I don't have no fear. I got Jesus on my side, and I'm not scared of you. Like you're nothing but a human being with skin on your with skin on you, and you, you when you die, you're gonna turn to dust. And if you die without Jesus, you're gonna go to hell. Like so, you better put your faith in Jesus and worry about Jesus and put your eyes on Jesus and stop watching me. Like stop watching people. Like you got your eyes on the wrong thing. You need to put your eyes on Jesus. You need to put your eyes on Jesus and you'll have peace within yourself. Because you don't have no peace when you're spying on people. Like, watching them and trying to harass them. You're demonic. You're a demon. And it's going to go all bad for you. I'm sorry to tell you that. It's all fun and games. Messing with people. Harassing them. But at the end, you're going to pay for it. And it's not going to be from me. It's going to be from God. Like, And I don't believe in karma. I don't believe in none of that stuff. That Hindu false stuff. Karma. And the other um, saying. What's that other saying? I believe in Jesus Christ. And what the Bible says. As he's the avenger. And you're payback people. For the wrongs they do to others. Is that to take advantage of people because you think they're like less smart because they have some type of disability as autism or any disability. When people take advantage of others because of the situation, they think they can get over somebody. That's how the world operates. People doing stuff because you're a faith, doing stuff because you're a thief, you're a Christian, and nobody should be harassed, I believe. Even nobody should be harassed because of their beliefs. Muslim, Hindu, Buddha, any religion, they shouldn't be harassed or like treating people bad because of their belief or because you don't agree with it. I don't agree with none of them religions. I believe they're all false. They're of the devil. But that doesn't give me a right to harass people and treat them bad. And not treat them like a human being as they are. And show respect to them. And be kind to them. And stuff like that. But that's not me agreeing with the religion. I'm just treating them as a human being. Same as the homosexual, kind to them, respectful, can live in peace with them. I'm not ter- I'm not territorial like some people are, cause I don't, I disagree on some things that the world accepts, and they get a territorial and they want to treat you some type of way. That's not what I'm saying is wrong. But this is what happens, yeah. <laughs> and like I said, I'm not entitled to talk to nobody. I'm not entitled to give nobody a conversation. I'm not entitled to talk to my neighbors. Even if they think it's rude, I don't talk to them. So what? Like, it's a free country. You know, like, I'm free to talk to who I want to talk to. Like, And 
and sniffing around and saying hi, like, hi, and be friendly, but I don't have to, like, socialize with you or socialize with anybody. I don't want to, so I don't like people that try to, like, think that I owe them a conversation or something like that because I don't owe you nothing, like... And that's how the last neighbor was, like, it seemed that way. And then they try to say you're stuck out, whatever. It's not that. I'm not stuck up. Took a while to find it. So I'm going to read you something interesting. Who goes to hell is the people that doesn't put their faith in Christ. That think they can live without Christ. Because you have all that career and all that stuff. All that money. It's not going to go with you when you die. And your soul is going to go to damnation, destruction, hell. Because you chose to live life without him. And he was like he was like he gave all his he gave his all he shed his blood for you and you chose to to neglect him and so you deserve hell you deserve hell I deserve hell but the only difference with me I put my faith in Christ and I'm trying to like strive and like be like him every single day even though I might mess up at times so let's get back up again Those who reject God in the only way to heaven through Jesus must go to hell. Hell is where God will punish Satan and all the people who follow Satan. And most people don't think they follow Satan, but follow Satan means you're going on your own way in life. You're going your own way in life. You're like practicing your false religions. That's not the true God of the Bible. And so, if you're not following Christ... You're gonna, you're following Satan. Most people don't think they follow Satan, but following Satan means going your own way and disobeying and dishonoring God. That's sin. The Bible says everyone has sin. No one measures up to God. Romans glory, Romans chapter 3, 23. And we all deserve hell. 
because of our sins, but God made a way to forgive sinners. He sent Jesus to die on the cross to take a pain and punishment sinners deserve. And if we trust Jesus, God takes us to heaven when we die. But those who reject God's way must be separated in hell forever, eternally, from the holy, perfect God. Anyone whose name was not written in the book of life was thrown into the lake of fire, Revelation chapter twenty fifteen. But here is how God has shown his love for us. While we were still sinners, Christ died for us. The blood of Christ has made us right with God, so we are even more sure that Jesus will save us from God's anger, Romans chapter 5, 8, 9. I have to do stuff, so I'll get back to the scriptures later. And what is today? Today is 10.44 a.m. Monday, May 23. 